and, and keeping in mind that the gear was released about what six months ago. So we're already into version two. Um, in version two, they've tripled the battery life. They've moved the camera off of the band and onto the watch. The watch is now, um, I think, half as thick as the old gear. But more importantly, what I observed was they're not running Android any longer. Yeah. They're moving to the Samsung OS called Tizen. And it'll be interesting to see. Is it Tizen or Tizen? Tizen. 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 Tizen? Whatever it is. <laughs> <clears throat> if Samsung wants to contact us, you know, here we go again. Instead of misspelling, we're just mispronouncing. So. So maybe maybe uh, Samsung uh, can jump uh, in the, uh, uh, the chat. Uh, 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 Michael, if you can uh, make sure you at uh, <laughs> Samsung and ask them how to pronounce their ties in. Is it a long eye? Is it tell, ask if it's a long eye and invite them in the chat room like we did with that guy from <laughs> uh, Kinder last week. I'm finally getting it right. I'm going to use that a bit this week. Mm-hmm. Um, it, we'll, we'll get this straight within the next hour, I'm sure. I'm sure somebody with some Sam- Samsung will be right on it. And I'm not saying that the devices completely changes my mind about about the Gear smartwatch. I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sold on it. But to go six months, make these drastic changes, and get that much. I mean, the devices are are a lot better than they were six months ago. Mm-hmm. If I if I had purchased the device six months ago, I'd probably be upset with myself. That's why you never buy the first version. <laughs> I don't know. The iPad one w- worked well. The Surface Pro. F- first gen I, I don't know there's there's some devices that are i guess the technology is more proven out for those kinds of, of things but I, i'm just looking at these this type of device and this is I, I as a pebble owner i i don't know i wish this isn't going to make me run out and get a samsung phone so i can use it and that's to me the one big drawback about this but i'm wondering if with switching os is if they'll move to some interoperability between and between between not just offering it on their Samsung Galaxy Note three and the S four and and they they launched or they announced the S five, um, which in addition to this with them switching the OS and swapping the OS.